Well, all my stuff is pretty much now gone. That explosion at the sea hall, I believe, was just a distraction because they've gone ahead and raided my apartment. But that is not the worst thing that's happened. The worst thing about this is Nugget and Cheesecake are now missing. So I have no idea if they're dead, alive. But there is one good thing about them raiding my base. The turkey that was on the ceiling is no longer there. So that's probably the only positive thing about this whole situation. But yes, hello everyone, Fudgy here, and welcome back to another Unturned Life episode. Well, I guess the other good thing is the fish tank here is completely fine. I guess they thought they had killed enough fish. So in the last episode, the sea hall got blown up by Cooper's guys, and my fish unfortunately also died. And it was a whole mess. In fact, it's still not even cleaned up yet. But now my apartment. And this is what I am more upset about. My apartment being destroyed. And of course, Nugget and Cheesecake going missing. Look at this. They've even taken my Soprano gear. That was on the mannequin there. They've moved everything. Not even my bed is in the same position. And look at this. Look at the toilet. How has the toilet been knocked over like that? It's a real mess in here, isn't it? Yeah. Everything is destroyed. I know, man. Uh, also, have you heard from Reds? No, oh, he's with Elias, I think, planning out something. Yeah, he mentioned that he was going to see Elias and try and sort all this out. This has gone too far now. I mean, they've literally yeah. destroyed my entire apartment, potentially killed my animals, and taken all my other stuff, man. Everything I got, like, nothing now. Wait, actually, to be fair, my backpack, I still have quite a lot of money in it and a couple of weapons, so I guess they didn't get everything oh, what about the balcony the balcony they've broken the door down yeah, well, but wait the what the Cooper. i have your uh, lovely Cooper? cow your lovely chicken and you know i like to make a trade with you here's the deal and what? listen up very closely on the uh, bridge you live and you deliver weapons and ammo on that bridge have a uh, 30 minutes let's be honest hang on a minute wait wait wait. be quick hey or they will die hey cooper cooper how did you get on this frequency i swear if you hurt my animals you don't need to know how i got the frequency i'm everywhere any place you can't escape so bring what i need and your lovely animals are free cooper Whenever I see you next, I'm going to kill you. You really think so? Well, good luck with that. You'll need. I'm guessing you heard that as well? Yes, that's not good. How did he get to the frequency? Has he been listening to us this entire time? Most likely, so that's real not good. We need to change our frequency. Yeah, 100%. Okay, so he said he wanted weapons and ammo at Bixby Bridge in 30 minutes. Otherwise, my cow and chicken, aka Nugget and Cheesecake, will die. Boris, I know you love them, but they're just animals and we can't arm them anymore. I'm really sorry. No, no, no. Okay, listen, listen. I've had these animals for a long time, all right? We, we need to get them back. I'm going there with or without you, okay? I don't have much on me, but maybe I can trade what I do have. I know I have a lot of money in this backpack. Maybe they'll, they'll accept that. So I'm going with or without you. I'm sorry. Okay. If you say that, I have to come with you. I'm going to call the guys and ask them to load up one of our cargo trucks. All right. Thank you, man. I really appreciate this. I've, I've lost so much already. If, if we can save those animals, then that would be great. Ace, I needed to load up one of our cargo trucks with some uh, supplies and uh, weapons. See, and, and because he's listening as well, it yep, also I'm means it. that uh, he can probably hear us saying that. So now he knows that we are going to go ahead with it. Let's get out of here. Are we going by helicopter, I'm guessing? Uh, yeah, hello. All right, sounds good. So here's the plan. We go to the airfield. Hopefully by the time we get there, the truck will be ready to go. I'm guessing we're going to bring a truck just filled with ammo and guns, right? And a Humvee. Back up. And a Humvee. Okay, that sounds good. This is going to work. It's going to work, man. They have everything. They even have the Shadow Stalker as well. Ah. Oh. I don't know how I'm gonna get my stuff back. Okay, I can see uh, I can see a truck down there. I'm guessing that's what they're loading up. And the Humvee. 
It's likely that all the Blue Braves would have heard that because it was on the frequency. So they know exactly what's going on right now. We shouldn't have to explain anything. Hey, fellas. Right, it's only me here, Boris. We're lone troops. Oh, wait. Just you? Where's everyone else? Every everyone else is on the front. I'm, I'm guessing you heard what Cooper said. Yeah, I did. All right. Well, how, how are you getting on? Have you loaded up any weapons yet? Oh, I can see some here. Yes. I think I got enough. All right. Let's just hope this works. Wait. Guys? had an idea and this might sound a little crazy and i don't know if it's gonna work or not but what if we rigged this truck i mean these guys these guys blew up my office they took all my stuff in my apartment and destroyed it and they've taken nugget and cheesecake which i don't even know if they're actually still alive this could all just be a trap another one of their traps which we know they do. So I don't know if we can trust them. But you know what? We're going to just... Uh, we're going to play dirty as well. All right? I like you, Eddie. I say uh, we just destroy the truck. You have something for me? Perfect for that. Yeah, just wait here. Okay, yeah, no worries. Yeah, it's got to work. Now, the only downside to this plan is... Well, one, it might not work and we could end up dying. But... It does mean we're likely going to lose all the weapons you've stored in here. But I would rather destroy them than them have the weapons, you know? I would say that's an acceptable loss, yeah. Exactly. I mean, it shouldn't be too bad for us. What have you got for me, man? Oh, yes. Okay, detonator perfect and charges. Yeah, you know what? I reckon probably free would do the trick. And now I need to hide them. Should I hide it? Underneath? Yeah, look at this. Just next to the tire. There's no way they're going to see this. Okay, there we go. I'll put all three there just in case. Okay, I need to hide that last one a little bit. That's kind of bad. Let's go right in the middle there. So as long as they don't look under the truck, we should get away with this. Okay, there we go. Here's another thing, right? Why, why weapons and ammo? Don't they already have like a lot of this stuff? Maybe they don't have our designs. So they could be looking for weaknesses in the designs of the weapons to, you know, be able to counter our, us better than what they've been doing. Yeah, maybe. All right, fellas, let's uh, let's just do this. We haven't got much time, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to drive this truck. They've said, obviously, to me at Bixby Bridge, which isn't far from here. So we'll drive over there. We'll uh, obviously keep our guards up, and hopefully everything will work out all right. Once they've taken the truck, I'm then going to detonate it once they start moving, okay? And that's when we're going to get out of there as quick as we can, all right? Yep. I'm we don't even know how many of them is going to be there and what kind of uh, armor, guns, and so on that they've got. It could be an ambush, so highly risky, but let's just do it. Let's go for it. Only three of us as well. This is such a terrible idea. Why are we doing this? Okay, but I do, I do need to get Nugget and Cheesecake back. We have to do that. I need them. I know it sounds ridiculous. All these guns for a cow and a chicken. But we have to do this. I am not letting them die. Okay, look. There's the bridge right there. That shows how close we are to them right now. It's a good place for an ambush, though. As long as I've got these two blue berets with me. It's a shame Reds isn't with us right now. But he is with Elias. Trying to sort out this whole situation. We are all on very, very high alert right now. Okay, we're getting pretty close to the bridge. Can't see anything just yet. Oh, wait. Hang on a minute. Up ahead, up ahead. That's them. Okay, let's just stop right here. Nugget cheesecake. I see them. I see them. Okay, they're still alive. Yes. Let's get my weapon out. All right. Fellas, we have, we have the weapons and the ammo, okay? Just uh, leave my chicken and cow alone, all right? Okay, feel free to check out the crates, okay? Have a look. It's all there. It's all there. I hope they're happy with what the Blue Braves have put in. I don't even know what kind of weapons are inside there. Okay. All right. I'm, I'm going to get my... I'm going to get my cow now, okay? And my chicken. Wow, that was actually pretty easy. No, no tricks. There we go. All right. See you, fellas. Okay, now. Here we go. Get ready, get ready. I got it, I got it. Okay, guys, let's dip, let's dip. I'm good, I'm good. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Uh-oh. 
Bad idea. Bad idea. Big mistake. Big mistake. Under heavy fire. This is Boris. All blue berets come in. We need air support right now. Big speed bridge. We are under heavy fire. Any blue berets in the area, please provide covering fire. Oh, jeez. I said just keep driving. Keep driving. This thing should, uh, should hold off for a while. It's got plenty of armor. At least I've got nugget and cheesecake now. Oh, yeah. There we go. Little bird inbound. Yes. Come on. Take it out. Did they get it? Yes, it's on fire. It's on fire. Okay, they're bailing, fellas. They're bailing. They're bailing. Yep, jump out. Let's go take them out. Take out the remaining enemies. I got him. I got I got it. Good job. Good job. One, I think. Okay, let's just clear this area. I only saw one run out, but there could be more around. Oh, yeah. Look, over there. Over there. Another one, another dead ahead. Dead ahead. Okay, I can see a lot of loot down here. I'm so glad we've got the little bird overhead now. But look, all I'm saying no is they've uh, they've trapped us a lot of times. So it's about time we get some revenge. Okay, did we do it? There's no way he survived that. Area now secured. Okay, guys, you know the drill. It's likely they're going to retaliate once again. So let's just be prepared, all right? Never, ever trust them. There's a good chance that they probably would have done something with those weapons that we gave to them, all right? Just keep that in mind. Even though it's now been destroyed... I think it was the only way out of there. I need to get Nugget and Cheesecake into a secure location, okay? There's a chance they might be sending in more people to get get back to us, okay? I might try and get my animals. Um, I need to hide them somewhere where no one knows. So, nah, if you can take me back to the safe zone, I'm going to try and rebuild some of the stuff that I lost. And, um, yeah, secure my animals, okay? Good work today, all right? If you see anything, let us know. We need to find a new frequency, too. The one... The one we are using right now is compromised. That's true. We do need a new frequency. I'll tell you what. I'll leave that in the hands with you, Elias, and Reds, okay? Just let us know what the new frequency is when you can, all right? All right. I'll try to get in touch with them and discuss it. All right. Good stuff. See you around, man. See you around. Be safe, boys. And you also, great work in the helicopter. Thank you for the air support. Okay, let's get out of it. Let's go back to the safe zone. Oh, man. That was insane. Very bold idea, but it worked out for the best. So we had no casualties or anything like that. Obviously, the Blue Berets did lose a truck. <laughs> a truck, well, filled with ammo and guns. But like I said earlier, I would rather destroy it, kill a couple of their guys, than them keep it. So, yeah. The question is, though, where am I going to hide Nugget and Cheesecake? I could put them in the hangar because surely no one knows about my hangar over there, like Cooper's guys. All right, now, I'm going to keep this between me and you, okay? And also the thousands of people watching right right now. But I'm going to put Nugget and Cheesecake in my hangar. I mean, that right there has a very secure door. There's no reason for anyone really to go in there. So it should be a nice little hiding spot for them. Now, if it's okay with you, and I know I've already asked a lot from you today, which I, you know, again, I really appreciate what you've done. I know we have lost quite a lot especially for a cow and chicken. That's how you see it in your eyes. I, I understand that. But if you can just quickly go into town, into the safe zone, gather maybe some supplies for them to survive in there. Um, maybe some furniture. I don't know. Maybe they want to chill. Whatever. I'd really appreciate that. Yeah. That sounds so weird saying that out loud about a chicken and a cow. But yeah, if you could do that for me, that would be great. Okay. And I'll meet you over there. Thank you, man. Thank you. See you in a bit. Right. Let's open up. Flying Blueberry should be in here. And, uh, yeah, I mean, this is a very secure place for them, right? It's got to be. Look at the doors on the front. Check it out. Nugget cheesecake. Oh, I'm so glad you guys are okay. Oh, man. Ah, <sighs> Yeah, I couldn't let these guys die. Now, over here, I have $5,000 just sitting there. Now, I'm going to give this to Nair because he's done a lot for me today. He's protected me, and he accepted doing this mission, this crazy mission which involved him losing some stuff. So $5,000. I probably shouldn't be giving away too much because, well, I've lost just about everything I own. Uh, but yeah, he definitely deserves this, I reckon. And not to mention, he is buying them some goodies right now. So I think it's important we give him something back. And oh, he's actually back now. Hey, Boris. Hey, now. I bought some supplies. Oh, Boris nice. Chicken coop. 
Perfect. Yeah, just but uh. It's quite big, so. Ye oh. I don't know where you want it. You know, anywhere where it fits, it's fine. Just anywhere, like in, in this side, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, there we go. That that works. Thank you, man. That's perfect. Um. Also, yeah. I have five thousand dollars for you here. Okay. Uh, just a little way of me saying thanks for what you've done today. I really appreciate it. Hey, thank you, man. A TV. A TV. Perfect. Yeah, they're probably gonna be yeah. stuck in here for a little while, so. Yeah, that's great. And a cow. <laughs> oh, man. I'm like the crazy chicken and cow person now. Oh, we got some Apollos. Okay, I'm just going to close this door. Even though I trust the Apollos, I want to keep this on the down low. I don't want anyone really knowing about this. Anyway, now that I have my animals back, I am going to end this one right here. There's another video on the top right, so make sure you go ahead and check that out. Also, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll hopefully see you in that video right there.